you been there before? The scrapyard? Nah. Just seen the sign on my way to camp. What if we just, like, walk to the main road? This isn't the main road? No, this is all Hackett property. The main road is another mile that way. Wait, how do I know so much more about everything than you do? Wait, shut up. So basically, it's another hour walk to the main road, and then at least another three to four hour walk until we hit the nearest... whatever? Yeah. What was that? Let's just keep moving. Okay. So... I guess this is me now. What? You're gonna look great with a hook. We can call you... Hooky in the cook face. Yeah, I guess it's pretty unique. I could get different attachments for it. <laughs> yeah, man. Lean into it. One hell of a story, too. Yeah, I guess it's something to talk about on the radio station. We're all gonna be laughing about this in a few years. You, me, maybe even Ryan. Kinda got close at the fire pit back there. Am I crazy or was something about to happen? There's always next year, right? Well, let's get through this year first. Wouldn't really matter anyway. It looks like we finally know Ryan's type. Confident and heroic with an eye patch. So pirates. Maybe she shivers his timbers. <laughs> there. Oh, shit. Relax. It's motion sensor. We're okay. I think. Oh, look. Steampunk's back in. Ew. Come on. This way. So what do we do now? Well, I guess we just make ourselves at home. Live up some cocktails, see what's on the TV. <laughs> no? Would you just cut it out, please? Cut what out? Acting like, like whatever it is you're acting like. It's not funny. Oh, sorry. My name's Abigail, and I'm clinically unable to have a good time. You see, I had it surgically removed when I was just a wee child. Hmm. Even when everything's falling apart, you still have to be the center of attention. Do you have an off button? Is there anything underneath all that look-at-me bullshit? Uh, Abby, I just... I just wasted so much time trying to figure out how to be like you. And I finally realized you need me to prop you up. You need an audience. And guess what? I am tired of being your audience. Sorry you feel that way. But you have been a wonderful audience. <laughs> Forget it. No. Abby. I need you. And maybe I'm just afraid that you'll realize you don't need me. You're my best friend. Well, fuck this nine, huh? Yeah. Come on. I want to hear you say it. Fuck this night. Fuck it all the way to morning. <laughs> Easy, Ma. Put me down, you old witch! Pull your fucking head up! Ah, bitch! 
everybody just relax. Can't shoot what you can't see, darling. Gotcha. Look at the force you did to my Kaylee. Everybody stop! Constance. What the fuck is going on up here? Uh, wake up. Wake up. Darling, come on. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Oh. She's gone. Little Bobby. Mom's gone. Cool. Yeah. No more party. No more protecting anyone. Travis.
There are bears around here. Dear darling. I thought you were shot. I got better. The bitch is bit. Oh, you're gonna shoot me again? That worked so well for you last time. <laughs> yeah. enough silver to kill you, but I could sure make you suffer. for you, I promise you that. Yeah. <laughs> 
Yo, come on, man. You gotta help me. I do? Yeah, I promise. I won't tell anyone anything. No, man. Family first. Besides, I'll get in trouble. Please! You stole my knife! Oh no, you've been bit! Pick on someone your own size. Travis! Oh, easy. Easy. What the fuck happened to you? Oh, you know, nothing out of the ordinary. Oh, Ryan! Oh, how bad is it? I'm so sorry. <sighs> that bad, huh? I keep trying to fix it. Whatever this is, people keep getting hurt. First Max, how are you? It's not your fault. I didn't have to come here. I shouldn't have let you come. Uh, you're not the boss of me. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. Am I dying? You've lost a lot of blood. But it'll, it'll heal though, right? Wait. Maybe it, maybe it will. What? Ryan, if you let me bite you. What? If you let me bite you, it means you'll be infected, which means. Which means it will heal. Yeah. But it also means... Yeah, yeah, I got it, Big Bad Wolf. Yeah. <sighs> Ryan, I don't have much time. I can feel it like it's fighting to get out. If you let me bite you and you heal, then... Then I have to kill Chris. It's, it's not killing Chris, it's killing a werewolf. It's saving your own life. And mine. And Max's and your friends, too. Let you bite me. And live to kill Chris Hackett. Or bleed out and die. Pretty much, yeah. It's your call, for now. So we doing this or no? and tender for you. You should start to feel better soon, I guess. Fuck. We gotta go. What? Uh, 
collar. guys never throw anything out, huh? So, do you want to give me some direction on what we're looking for specifically? Well, most of these cars look like they've already been stripped apart. It's just empty frames and chassis, which doesn't help us much. Okay, so we're looking for... engines? Well, anything relatively intact. Got it. Problem. Ugh, fuck sticks. I mean, there must be a way to open it. Mm -hmm. Maybe in that house thing. Let's take a look. Documentary. No. Shut up. Come on, let's go. These sons of bitches had it all planned out. Who's T? Looks like these guys were cooking the books a little. Dodgy. You said it.
can find, okay? He knows what he's doing. Probably safer than we are out here. Come on. So, you ever operated a crane before? I actually used to be pretty, pretty good at the claw game at my local arcade. The kids used to call me the grabber. No, no, uh-uh. Uh-oh, I hear that now. Look, why don't you see if you can lower it down so I can take a look under the hood? Sure, yeah, sure thing. Um. Just uh, watch my back, yeah? Yeah. All right. Looks like somebody's mom never taught them how to clean up after themselves. Okay, let's see what we're working with. All right, not too complicated. Welcome back, Grabber. Now you're falling away, will you? What the hell is going on? My bad. Ah, oh, shit, okay. All right, here goes nothing. I think I found my calling. About time! <laughs> well, maybe we can see if we can try and get this thing running. <gasps> Score!
Dylan, thank you. You actually saved my life. For realsies. Yeah, you know, no sweat. I just can't wait to see who they choose. What? To play me in the movie about how brave I am. Don't push it. <laughs> okay. <sighs> so, so much for our brilliant escape plan. Okay, back to the lodge. Are you nuts? <laughs> Better than being out in the open. Come on. We can't just sit here. Why not? Dylan said it's safe here. Well, yeah, I just, I don't want to be waiting around. But that's literally all we need to do. Just wait until morning, right? Fine. But we need protection. Go see what you can find. It's better than just sitting around. Looks like the main fuse is gone. That's why there's no power? Why would somebody do that? What is it? Silver shells. How'd they get down here? The hunter must have dropped them. This is probably how he got upstairs and attacked Caitlin. These fucking guys are everywhere. Hope it holds. What'd you find? Oh, I'm just checking out this ladder. Is that a tiny little door up there? Uh, yeah. We'll open it up. Why? We don't know what's up there. Exactly. Have you not been paying attention, like, 
at all. Okay, what I mean is it might be good for us to have an escape route. You know, we don't know what's up there. It, it, the lodge, there, there also could be a, a way for us to defend ourselves. Okay. Guess that makes sense. That was close. Getting through there in a hurry. Man, this place is huge. I might need to rest a bit. You'll feel better soon. Cool. I'm feeling pretty good, actually. What are you doing? Stop it. Do you smell that? No. Never mind. Let's just find another way down. A way to Chris Hackett. Or just a way out, maybe. I'm done being chased and stabbed. Sure. And another way out. Fine. Watch your step. Yep. What was that? I think... I think we found Chris Hackett. Thanks. 
for um, not killing me. Yeah. Likewise. So, what now? Everyone's back to normal? What? Oh. You think this is over? This isn't over. I don't understand Chris is dead. Huh. Well, Chris wasn't the first. That's not possible. Caleb. Kaylee. The girl you killed? Her brother. What? <sighs> Caleb bit Chris and Kaylee. Chris was just trying to protect him. He was a good man, my brother. Well, then who bit Caleb? Silas. They've been tracking him for years. He's a, a gypsy, a transient. He'd been long gone from the area, but we hoped he'd come back so we could end this. Anyway, there's sightings up and down the coast. A uh, feral albino child, giant white wolf. White wolf? What? What'd you say? Where? Where'd you see it? Hey, let him go! At the, the cabins earlier tonight. Okay. Okay. Okay, it makes sense. It all makes sense. Uh, he must have been back for months, and he's what ran you off the road two months ago. Help me. Help me. We can still save Caleb. We can still save what's left of my family. We, we can help those who are still alive. Why the hell should I trust you? I'm not asking you to trust me. I'm telling you we can end this. We kill Silas, everyone gets better. Everyone, uh, who's still alive anyway. Okay, okay, so... Where would we even find him? I know exactly where to find him. Okay, let's go. This doesn't mean I forgive you for what you did to me. I understand. Can someone please get me some fucking clothes? You had your chance. You had your chance to wipe out that wretched family, and you failed. <laughs> Doesn't matter. There's still time. We can still come out on top. Past is the past. Let's just <clears throat> look to the future, shall we? The sun. The vitality of a new day. There's still time to wake up to the warmth of a night survived. Your choices, your actions, your very life hangs in the balance. It's up to you to find your path in the darkness and see the sun rise once again. The Hierophant! Where did you find this? Where did you find it? This shouldn't be here. He's been through enough pain. No, no, no. My poor boy. You see what that did to us? No. <laughs> what have they done? 
What have they done? Mommy's coming, Silas. Mommy's coming, Silas! 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 Oh, they hurt us. He's out there still, all alone. Each full moon, they hunt him, armed with silver, trying to put an end to a curse they inflicted upon themselves when they set my show ablaze six years ago. Stupid children. Little silence. My little white wolf. You must be protected. You must not follow this path. Do you understand? Remember how I've helped you all this time? Remember how much I've done for you? 